so this reading is going to be for uh, cancer let's start with the three sounds So let's see <coughs> what is hold for cancer in the month of November. <coughs> what about their love life? Please divine guide me about cancer love life for the month of November. Let's see your past, present and future. past <coughs> this is present and this is future and overall energy is the empress for the reading so let's start with your overall energy for the month of november <coughs> So, the Empress for the overall energy. So, when it comes for the overall energy that uh, you want to nurture yourself, you want to feel abundant, you want to connect with the universe, you want to connect with the people. Or maybe there's a business which you want to go worldwide. Let's clarify the Empress. One more. Let's clarify. The Magician. Okay, so you're creating something very big for yourself. Because the Empress is the major arcana card. Enter it. And the Magician. So you're creating, you're manifesting something. You're manifesting the life what you're looking for. So this is our overall, you're a manifester. Okay, let's see in your current, sorry, your past. It's four of cups. King of cups. And king of swords. So I can see in past you were bored, kind of. Someone made you offer. You want to take a lot of action. Or this person is take, worth taking a lot of action. But I think you didn't show any interest to them. <clears throat> they came with a very solid offer. And they have a lot of emotions for you. Let's clarify the four of cups. The strength. Maybe you were holding back to this person. You were taking your time to say them yes or no. Or maybe you were observing them. Mm. Let's clarify King of Cups. Ace of Swords. Let's clarify Knight of Swords. King of Wands. Hmm. So, King of Cups is clarified by Ace of Swords. This person wanted a new beginning with you, or maybe they they wanted to talk to you, and they wanted to some. They wanted to clarify something with you. And uh, they showed a lot of passion towards you. But then what is this holding you back? Let's check. Okay, in parent, uh, 
present situation is page of cups then ten of cups and then the moon let's clarify the page of cups in present situation king of swords ten of cups is clarified by eight of wands the moon clarified by six of cups <clears throat> I think the person you are dealing with they are looking for answer from you or they want to get clarification from you or maybe you want some clarification from them they want to talk about future with you about uh, uh, they want to I think they want to give you commitment and they want or maybe they want commitment from you you are confused you also about the life you also want a stability in your life but you are a little confused about this offer or you want to give them some offer you want to talk about the future you might have received a message also from the government would have would be speaking regarding the future is something you are holding from this person you don't want to give the commitment you are confused or this person is confused maybe do you don't trust this person much or you don't trust yourself or you are not ready for the commitment let's put it this way i think you are not ready for the commitment at this point of time you're a little confused let's clarify <clears throat> okay uh, in future there's a two of cups eight of swords and page of wands this person feels like a soulmate to you you have lot of passion towards them then what is stopping you to commit to them it is so so a lot of confuse and you want to put an effort but you're confused you want to have a fresh start with them or you want to be you feel very much attracted towards them but there's something which is holding you back uh let's clarify two of cups two of cups is clarified by the fool let's clarify eight of swords just clarified by the temperance let's clarify the page of wands <clears throat> you feel like giving a chance to them is like a taking a risk you are just praying to universe to show you the direction you want to take your time to decide on this this particular relationship i feel guided by the divine this is what i feel that universe wants you to be together but you want to spend time alone you want to take your time let's see what is in your what is the outcome for the situation <clears throat> the 
the emperor. Let's clarify the emperor. The hangman. Ah, you are stuck. You are confused. You want to take your time. You want to be logical. You want to take the power, take the control of this situation in your hand. You want to play with your mind, not with your emotions. Mm, situation stuck. Let's have a card from the angel. Let's, let's see what angels are trying to tell you or the advice. One card. Power. You are reminded at that your essence is divine so let no one diminish you when you feel totally serene and at peace you're powerful for no one can upset or influence you your angel guidance is to find your still quiet center then heal your anger purify your emotions rely on your own judgment and take your own decision it serves your spiritual growth to take responsibility for your life so stand on your own feet and be strong true power is based on inner strength self-worth and confidence claim your power today You need to decide about this situation, Cancer. You need to decide do you want this person to take in your life or not. You are thinking from your head, not from your heart. Take your time. Decide what exactly you are looking for. Do you want to give a chance to this relationship? Or you don't want to. But this person looks very much passionate towards you. And I can see this is a soulmate kind of relationship and which is a divine guided relation. Anyway, this is for you guys for the month of November. If you this resonates with you, please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel. I really appreciate. Thanks for today. Thanks for watching.